edition of the United States Trotting Association Boots and Saddles Race. Here's the field for the first division of the United States Trotting Association Boots and Saddles Series, an early closing event. There is no paramutual wagering on the race. There is a purse of $2,500. Lenny B, number one, owned by Helen and Anthony Barber, the drivers, Tony Barber. All Night Strut, number two, owned by Paul Minori, driven by Leah Vandevoort. Earl of Isla Verde, number three, owned by Sue Kovacek and uh, Joni Farmer. And the uh, rider is Sue Kovacek. Spectacular Deal, number four, owned by Corinne and Sandy Goldfarb and driven by Samantha Hurst. In the uh, first non-betting race this afternoon, number three, Earl of Isla Verde, races without the medication Lasix. This field is at the starting gate. There is no paramutual wagering on this race. One mile with a purse of $2,500. Field is on gate. And they're off in the boots and saddles, and quickly from the outside, spectacular deal rushes out for the lead. Lenny Beal on the inside gets away, second all nice threat, and the distant trailer right now is Earl of Isla Verde. They move around the first turn, go down the back stretch at Friol, showing the way easily to the field is spectacular deal and Samantha Hurst. She's in front by five widening lengths as they approach the quarter pole at Friol. Spectacular deal in front by five or six. Lenny B holds on in second, three ahead of All Night Strut in third, and the distant trailer is Earl of Isla Verde with the best view. Opening quarter at Free All was 28 and one. They move on to the far turn the first time. Spectacular deal trying to go away from this field and hide. Leads it now by eight, nine widening lengths. They're at the top of the stretch the first time. Spectacular deal, a five-year-old making first start of the season, leads the field by 10, 12 lengths. The battle right now is for second position, moving up on the outside, all night strut, takes over second, back in third, Linny B, and trying to rally late is Earl of Isla Verde. Half mile, 57 and three, spectacular deal, all by himself, leads the field by 20, 25 lengths, as they head down the back stretch the final time, spectacular deal, all by himself, leads the field by 25 lengths. Up in second position now is Earl of Isla Verde, who's made a nice comeback. Four lengths ahead of uh, All Night Strut, and now trailing the field is Lenny B. They reach the three quarter pole. Spectacular deal is in another world. Leads three quarters in 129 and one. And all Samantha Hurst has to do is stay on board. She's got an easy win here coming up top of the stretch. Spectacular deal draws away by two, three, four city blocks. That's a lot of blocks. It's all spectacular deal in front. How sweet it is. No competition for a spectacular deal. The winner of the first division of the Boots and Saddles here at Freehold. Finishing second was Earl of Isla Verde. Finishing third and trying to hold on there is All Night Strut. And Lenny B brings up the finish in 2-2-2 two, two, and two for the mile. Voucher from Acquired Skill by the great Brett Hanover. Owned by Corinne and Sandy Goldfarb of Old Westbury, New York. Trained by Charlie Kaminsky and the winning rider this afternoon, Samantha Hurst. Congratulations to Samantha Hurst, the winning jockey here with Spectacular Deal. The result of the Boots and Saddles race is now official. Second